Doctors Without Borders workers collect huge amounts of data from their clinics and hospitals that need to be manually entered into a healthcare system called DHIS2. We delivered a tool that uses large language models to improve the quality of data entry and to make this process easier. To log into the tool, you need to use your credentials for DHIS2, the Doctors Without Borders medical database. Doctors Without Borders data encoders can upload up to 10 photos of data sheets to the tool at a time. While the GPT model analyzes the image for text, the user can enter in metadata about the form. After loading, the image shows up in a data table. You can edit both the numbers and the rows and columns of the table. Once the numbers look right to you, press the Correct to DHIS2 Field Names button to ensure that the labels are the same as in the database. The Confirm button saves the data. The Generate Key Value Pairs button shows the user what will be entered into DHIS2, which can be useful for double checking. Once the user has completed the form, they can submit their work to DHIS2 and clear the form to restart. In the future, this program may become an important part of Doctors Without Borders data collection workflow. Thanks for watching! This project was a part of the 2024 Data Science for the Common Good program, which is run by the Center for Data Science at UMass Amherst and led by Virginia Partridge, the Associate Director of Data Science. This project was in collaboration with Doctors Without Borders. The team that worked on the project are Anju Santosh Kumar, Yaji Lee, and Robin Javarchand.